Your gifts in the spirit are tools. So you need to use your tools. Now let me show you. 1 Corinthians chapter 12. Therefore I make known to you that no one speaking by the Spirit of God calls Jesus accursed, and no one can say that Jesus is Lord except by the Holy Spirit. It's very simple. Verse 3, that's verse, uh, verse 4. There are diversities of gifts, but the same Spirit. Uh -huh. There are differences of ministries, but the same Lord. There are diversities of activities, but it's the same God who works all in all. So understand, don't let anybody downplay your ministry, specifically how God uses you, how he's using you through the Spirit of God. It may look different, but if we test it and say, hey, this is the same Holy Spirit, then what should be the problem? Don't, any, don't let anyone downplay you. Okay, but understand verse 7. The manifestation of the Spirit is given to each one for the profit of all. For to one is given the word of wisdom through the Spirit, to another the word of knowledge through the same Spirit, to another the, the gift of faith, to another the gift of healings, working of miracles, uh, prophecy, discerning spirits, uh, different types of tongues, and interpretation of tongues. But it's the same Spirit who does these things. So listen, family, if you're feeling heavy or oppressed, you need to use the gift of tongues to pray. Oh, I, I, I just feel bound down and, and my spirit came to say, Ripo kupo tarabasela, neson de la paya. All of a sudden, the spirit of God begins to mount up on you and you build up yourself in your most holy faith, as the Bible has said. Then your spirit can break free from chains and stuff like that. So the more that you use these tools, it's just like you do anything. Riding a bike, you, 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 you regulate this thing or, or you become sharpened by it by the way that you practice and your frequency of practicing. So use your tools and become a master over the gift that God has given you to steward. Then other people will be blessed and many people will benefit from what God has given you. Hallelujah. Understand that when I begin to prophesy, when I begin to prophesy, sometimes I would miss and it's okay. But you continue on until you hit the target. You begin to hit the target, hit the target, hit the target. Then you understand you're being sharpened in that specific area. When you use the gift, it becomes sharp. Now I want to pray with you. Father, in the name of Jesus, I pray by the Holy Spirit that you would activate everyone's gifts that's watching this. By the Holy Spirit, may your gifts become activated. May they be empowered and charged up by the fire of the living God, by his anointing. May you increase in anointing. May you increase in your gift. May your gift become sharp as you regulate it and use it. Let it be activated now by the power of the living God. In the name of Jesus Christ right now, I activate those gifts. God is activating those gifts in Jesus' mighty name. Amen and amen. Take care.